It's a big day for India's moon mission. Chandrayaan 3's Vikram lander is scheduled to separate from the spacecraft's propulsion module today. In, in fact, in fact, moments from now, the lander and rover Pragyan are expected to land on the moon on August 23rd. Once on the moon, the Vikram lander will photograph the Pragyan rover, which will deploy its instruments to study seismic activities in the lunar surface. India's ambitious moon mission Chandrayaan-3 successfully completed its fifth and final lunar-bound orbit maneuver yesterday, bringing its spacecraft even closer to the surface of the moon, the closest at least it has been till now. Having completed all its lunar-bound maneuvers, the spacecraft will now prepare to separate the Vikram lander from the propulsion module. And I'm being joined by my colleague Pallav Bagla right now. Pallav, um, how important is this for Indians, for India? Explain this from a very layman's perspective. Well, this is India's third mission to the moon and for the first time India is attempting and may succeed in doing a soft landing on the moon. So the maneuver which will happen today after 1 p.m. is that the propulsion module and the Vikram lander will separate from each other and go in independent ways. The propulsion module has done its work so far, and now really the work will start for the Vikram lander, which has Pragyan rover in its belly, and if all goes well, on 23rd of August, we should see a soft landing of the Vikram lander with Pragyan rover, which will be the first soft landing on a celestial body outside Earth by India. So it is indeed a, a big deal. And today's maneuver is uh, important and a, a next step in Chandrayaan 3's mission. So far, Chandrayaan 3 has gone uneventfully and it has performed exactly as the Indian Space Research Organization expected it to work. And today's maneuver, where they separate the propulsion module, which is essentially a lot of fuel which was taking the Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft to the moon and the Vikram lander, they will separate and go separate ways. And after that, the Vikram lander will continue its journey. And on 23rd would be the big day for which India is waiting with bated breath to have a soft landing of the Vikram lander near the south pole of the moon. And that is an important achievement if that succeeds and ISRO has worked hard towards that. Right. In fact, Pallav, even as uh, you know, we just end this conversation here, just a, a cider, this seems to be a jugglebandi, jugglebandi around the 23rd of August, isn't it? In your that words. See, right now, right, see, India launched its uh, Chandrayaan-3 satellite and several days after that, Russia launched its Luna 25 probe. Today, both the Luna 25 Russian probe and Chandrayaan-3 are both orbiting the moon. And in a way, they are making music together around the moon and both expect to launch near the south pole of the moon. A Luna 25 is expected to land between the 21st and 23rd of August and India's Vikram lander is expected to land near the south pole of the moon on 23rd of August. India can't attempt a landing before that because it has to be done on what is called the lunar dawn because India's Chandrayaan 3 is Vikram Lander is solar powered. Right.